think you're doing your things over.
Well, he's now advancing down the hill. Right. You're supposed to be saying this, Harold. I shouldn't have to narrate. How can you run with your sound head door open? How can you run with your sound head door open? And then I always leave it open? Yeah. Yeah, I do. From habit. Yeah. I'm never going to have to look in and see the film. It doesn't make any difference in the sound. Theater, and uh, during the war, he was in the Air Force. 
and uh, after after they uh, you got out of the Air Force and set the rocks of Dean on the West Coast, and then when they opened the drive-in back in 1952, he became the operator at the drive-in, and he was there until 1967. Then they built the theater in Southern in 1967. George left the drive-in and went to the Ford Theater in, in Southern and remained there for years until, well, he's still going, but he eventually became the operator and the manager at the Ford Theater in Southern. And uh, he, still, he still works at the Ford one or two nights a week, but he doesn't, doesn't veneer projection from anymore. So that's the history of Local 855. And uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, this gentleman, five, the whole, all except this one. One, two, three, four. There's four, four in. Oh, okay. And the rest are all with me as far as I know. Okay. Thank that's, you, Harold. That's about it.